Hi there, this is Duran with bestsaxophonewebsiteever.com and today I want to talk to you about ligature position on the mouthpiece. So, it's uh, just something to be aware of. Um, and generally the way I like to position my ligature on the mouthpiece is more or less in the center, from, and by center I mean front to back. So you'll see this is where my mouthpiece starts, this is where it ends obviously, and the ligature is kind of sitting in the middle. So uh, here's a quick example of what that type of ligature placement uh, results in uh, sound-wise. <laughs> So um, now I'm going to go ahead and move the ligature back. And what I find um, happening when I move the ligature back towards the back of the mouthpiece is it makes the re it constricts the reed less and it gives the um, feel of a softer reed. So if you've ever got a reed that's too hard to play um, and you're on a gig, you need to get through it, I would consider just trying to move that ligature back a bit and it'll soften the reed up for you. Okay, so the next scenario is, let's say you got a reed that's a little bit too soft to play enjoyably. So what I do is, I just take the ligature and move it up to the front of the mouthpiece. It constricts the reed a little bit more and makes it feel like a harder reed than it actually is. So, um... Yeah, it felt like a harder read. Now, I don't know if you could hear the tonal difference between the three examples I played you, but I definitely felt a difference in terms of the uh, embouchure and the amount of air I had to put through the horn. So, hopefully this hack helps you manage the uh, many different uh, varieties of reads that you'll find within the same box, and I hope it helped you. So again, this is Duran at bestsaxophonewebsiteever.com, and have a great day. Mm-hmm.